Hi, I'm Irfan. Here I will share how to create a click text effects that you can edit in Inkscape. The method is very easy by watching this video. I hope you can follow it. I also set up the color palette used for this text effect. You can just take a screenshot this in this video. Okay, here I open an Inkscape. Get a text effect like this. Okay, here, here I create a rectangle and here I drag and drop the color palette like this and resize this rectangle 500 and 300 pixel okay and then here I give on the uh, cream color you can use a dropper tool okay and then here I create a um, text here I type uh, inkscape for font we use a uh, robot tool and for font width heavy and for font size we we number uh, 58 point and for the space okay give a yellow color um, red color and for a stroke pen mm, give a for width will number um, five pixel and click this icon can give a color for stroke and then you can you can clone this text with clone original path And then click pad, pad effect, and click allow transform, and then you can edit for this text. Okay, enable stroke pane and disable for fill. Here I give a mm, yellow color for stroke pane, and then for stroke style, we fill number four pixel. And then click lower selection one step. And you can move like this. And here I duplicate the yellow object with stroke pane, yellow stroke pane. And then here, give a blue color without stroke pane. And then you can click lower selection one step. Okay. Yeah, I duplicate again. And then here I give a dark blue color for stroke pin. And then here I click stroke style and here I will number two pixel from the stroke and then you can move and click lower selection one step okay you can move the objects manually like this okay yeah I'm sorry okay let's try on I did this text
okay you can add the text like this here I type blender mm, wow it's awesome Kim um Krida and he type uh Inkscape again okay next here I here I create um new text okay here I type on um, draw freely okay for the font here is um, a robot font for font weight we choose a heavy and for a font size we fill number 23 and for spacing between text we fill number 6.8 Okay, and make center like this. Okay, mm. open fill and stroke, enable stroke pane, mm. and then for fill, give a cream. And for a stroke pin, give a light, light blue, yeah. Oh, yeah. Give a this color. For the stroke pin. Hmm. For stroke style, for width with number 1.4 pixel. And then here I create um rectangle object, enable for fill, and without stroke pen, here I give um red color like this. And for this duplicate and for this object here I keep um this color okay and then here I um group this object and then duplicate and drag like this and then click a flip selected object horizontally okay can make center like this yeah yeah I did uh, many many Sorry, mm. sorry. Yeah. Okay, and next we create um like clips object. Create um manually like this. Here I give a uh, um sorry this color. Mm, sorry. Uh, here I and then duplicate give uh, this color and click lower selection one step like this and then you can group like this and you can move manually like this mm, sorry give a uh, black color and then you can move this object like this and then you can scale 
like this and then the I group on the scale okay duplicate and drag duplicate and drag and scale duplicate okay and scale yeah and then duplicate and then okay duplicate okay now the text like glitch effect and here I I'll create a rectangle again with um yellow color and you can drag like this okay now for selection one step and you can scale manually like this duplicate Our selection one step duplicate our selection one step and duplicate again like this our selection one step and duplicate our selection one step Okay, next we we try create like this object. Yeah, I create a rectangle. Give a red color. Yeah, and duplicate this object and scale. Give a stroke pane without fill. For a stroke pane, uh, we give a blue color hmm, sorry uh, a blue color like this okay and then you can drag like this and move and rotate and scale yeah I duplicate hmm, sorry uh, yellow color and we can scale and rotate like this okay duplicate and drag and move from this object give a red color okay yeah I select the stroke and on the stroke style we fill number three pixels okay here i group this object manually like this mm. and then group to one group and duplicate this object and you can group clip and click set okay Next, we create um, dots like this. Create a um, circle object with no stroke pane. Okay, here I resize. Here I will number two pixels and click edit, clone, create it create file clone and click shift uh, here I uh, type uh, 100 and here I click type uh, 100 for column 100 for shift X and for row 100 for shift Y and for, for column 6 and 6 and here I delete this object
and then you can scale like this and you can scale this object and clone with scale 2 okay here I duplicate this object and then create a clip like this object clip and click set okay okay after watching this video i hope you can do this text effect like this and okay that's enough for this video sorry if there's something wrong or missing thanks for watching and see you in the next video